And now, the moment you ha have been waiting for, a birthday party for Jiwo! Thank you all for being here today. Happy birthday, Jiwo! You are now 14 years old. I have a present for you. Aw, thanks, Mom. You shouldn't have. <laughs> this is the sword your father used. He was very strong and kind, but he lost his life in battle. I really don't want to hand this sword to you, but it's the law of this land to hold the sword and go to battle when a boy turns 14. Oh well, this is our sword, yeah! You press the A button to swing it, and let's go talk to our friends who showed up to our birthday party. Wow! I want a sword too! I can't wait till I hit the big one four! Ah, Pico, you're cool. And Billy, I have a sword too. Not a rusty one like that. It's a brand new sword. And of course, of course Billy has to be like the douchebag of the group. <laughs> and Alice, happy birthday, Jiwo. That is a beautiful sword. Yeah, everybody loves us. Let's talk to our mom again. Well, it's a sad tale, but try to honor your father's intent. And let's just sit around while we wait for fireworks. There we go. Huh? Fireworks? Is someone leaving today? By the way, it's the day Amon... It's the day Brave Amon leaves. Let's go see him. Don't forget to give me a send-off too, when my turn to go comes, okay? Oh, Billy, becoming a hero is not an easy task. You'll never become one if you don't train yourself at Rafael Sia Training Ground. Come on, hurry! I like Amon! I like all strong heroes! <laughs> Report your birthday to His Highness, the King! Alright, looks like we gotta go to the castle. Oh, let's check out our dog's house first. Max house, don't feed him, cause he'll get fat! Signed, Jiwo. Bow wow wow, yippee oh yippee <laughs> Very nice. Okay. So let's talk to this wise man. I see you've grown old enough to carry a sword, Jiwo. Now have you heard about the medals? Yeah, but I'll say no just for the sake of information. <laughs> the training ground consists of beginning, intermediate, and expert courses containing bronze, silver, and gold medals. Collect and take them to the castle. The king will exchange them for the holy sword, the true sign of a hero. Cool. Hey, here's our buddies. Isn't the castle up ahead? I'm waiting for Amon. I want to give him a send-off. Being a hero is every man's dream. I'm sure Amon will be a great hero one day. And Billy. Jiwo, I think you should report to the king about your 14th birthday. Alright. Hey, and I guess that's Amon. Well done, Amon. You have passed the trial. Here is your reward. ba -na -na -na. Thank you, your highness. This sword will be a great encouragement. Your journey will be a long one, but I expect you to do well. Good luck! Yes, your highness. Alright, let's talk to the king. That sword, you must be Jiwo. Yes, it has been a long time. Your father was so brave, he saved the town many times with the, that very sword. Enough old tales for now. You have come to report your 14th birthday, have you not? I will grant you the right to train at the Rafelsia Training Ground. Train hard and train well. Let's talk to the advisor. Rafelsia is a training ground to become a hero. Train hard and train well. Okay, um, let's just head on out. We can explore the castle at a later time. I mean, we'll be back. I saw Amon leave! He looks awesome! After all, he is the hero. <laughs> Alright, so let's just... Actually, um, I'll show you this plaza to the left, or to the west of the town. Might as well show you this too. Some fun stuff. It's the church. Long ago, there was an abominable event here. People no longer visit. We must have peace with all creatures, and bring harmony into people's hearts. That's right. Peace and harmony all around. I've been thinking ever since I spoke to your mom. Being a hero might seem glamorous, but in reality, you have to kill and take away life. But without heroes, we will be killed by monsters. What should we do? Oh, that is the conundrum, Alice. <laughs> we fight to defend those we love, yet 
you know, it's it's a horrible thing that we have to take away life. But anyway, that see that uh, golden apple down there? Oh, you know, I also forgot to mention, instead of hearts in this game, we have apples. And gold apples, as you can see down there, I think they're called apple of life. Apples of life. Um, they will boost your maximum health up one. So this is pretty much the... Oh, this is the plaza. While the town we were just in is the village of Soleil. So here's Chaya. The fortune teller at the plaza is pretty accurate, but she's off today. Oh, guess we don't get to see the fortune teller today. This is a plaza for kids. Why don't you join us and play? Oh, sure, yeah, but I gotta go train, become a hero. Ah, so here's a house. The House of Mermaid. For a limited time, you can see a mermaid for free. And... Would you like to increase your maximum HP? I will sell you 1 HP, but the cost is 800 malin, malins. So malins is the currency in this game. This may sound rude, but you don't look like you can afford it. Oh, thanks. Jeez, big time rolling. Big time roller. That mermaid must be rich. And this is the fortune teller's house, but she's not in right now, as Chai told us. So let's just get out of here, go back to the town of Soleil, and actually let's cut down some, some bushes. Head back to Soleil, then go to the Rafelsia Training Ground, where we can learn some fancy techniques. <laughs> doo doo. And I love the music in this game, seriously. This is an amazing game. It's only natural that I like this game because, you know, was it published by Atlas? And, you know, Atlas has published all the awesome games. So, anyway, let's head to the Rafelsia School. Like, per. Let's see. You must be Jiwo. I received a message from the king. You may enter. Oh, thank you, sir. Well, let's enter this house now. It's the sword thrower. I'm an expert at sword throwing. You are very lucky, my boy. My boy. <laughs> you can buy the sword throwing skill for just 20 malins. Hmm, it looks like you don't have enough money. Come back when you have some hard cash, son. I pity the fool. <laughs> hey, it's Billy, the douchebag. Hey, Jiwo, did you go to the plaza just west of Soleil? Yeah. What a wimp. If you keep hanging around there, you'll never be a hero. Uh-huh. It's funny, because we're going to see him there later. Anyway, it's Duffy. I am the instructor. You know the purpose of this training ground, don't you? Yes, but I'm just going to say no again. Then I will explain. Your goal is to finish all three courses. In each course, there is a treasure chest containing a bronze, silver, or gold medal. Collect all three. Read these signs and choose the best course for you. So since we're just a weak, a weakling, let's go to the beginner's course. It's very easy and anybody can clear it. Cool. So let's go chop down, get ourselves some Malin. Malin. I'll call it Malin. I know, it takes a while to cut all this down. It's a bit of a bummer, but you gotta do what you gotta do just starting out. I mean, it'll be a lot easier later on in the game. So, let's go around. Oh, I didn't read the sign, huh? Slash the red switch and light the fuse. I will slash the right red switch because I know what happens if you slash the left. If you slash to the left, yeah, you get spikes all around you, and I'm gonna have to take some damage to escape. But you gotta do what you gotta do, I suppose. Let's slash open some boxes. Yeah, get some coins over here. Cool. Making good time. Rubber band. <laughs> so let's talk to this guy over here. It's a trainee. You must be new here. Let me give you some advice. You must learn the running jump on your own. You can't learn it here. It seems we can only complete the beginner's course. Let's take it easy. Whoa! Yes, let us take it easy. I think there's a coin behind. Yeah, there we go. Ba da 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 da. We gonna get any coins here? Ah, uh, whatever. Anyway, if you head to this dirt path on the right, it's a monster crossing. So you're gonna see your first enemies here. It's an inchworm. They turn into balls when they. Yeah, I got you they get hit. But, I mean, that's about it. There's nothing really to do over there, so... Let's just head over here and gather some more coins. Yes, we're at 17 Malin. 
looking good. Oh no, it's a fire flamethrower. <laughs> Who puts that in a novice training course, seriously? That's just like asking for death. Okay. So we have 18 gold. Or Malin. Jeez, I'm so used to saying gold from Landstalker. Huh. But we are playing a new game now. New game. It is called Malin, Crusader of Seni. Alright, so this is gonna be pretty fun. As soon as you hit this red switch. Oh my gosh. Oh wow, as, as I step on spikes, all these bees appear. And so if you can destroy them, they will drop a, one Malin for you. So, ah, um, there we go. And we are up to 21, 22, 21 Malin. So once we get back to the start of this training ground, we can actually... Ooh. Yeah, we can actually buy the sword throwing skill. Whoa, what the heck is all this craziness? Okay, so we're just gonna dodge all these. Whoa! And just walk through some water over here, like the cool people we are. And guess what? That is the end of the beginner's training course. So let's open this chest, and Jiwoo collects the bronze medal! Awesome. So I think there's some apples here. Yeah, we can recover our life. See, who needs hearts when you can recover your life using apples? Anyway, so we're back on the over overworld, and let's go buy the sword throwing skill. I'm an expert at sword throwing. You are very lucky, my boy. For a limited time, the sword throwing skill can be yours for just 20 Mullins. What do you say? Yeah! Abra, abra, kadabra. Like the song. Abra, kadabra. I wanna reach out and grab ya. Jiwo load the. <laughs> Jiwo load. Jiwo learned how to throw the sword. Hold the A button to accumulate power and then let it go. You can throw your sword. You can throw your sword by accumulating your power. So just hold down your A button and. Whoa! You can throw it. This is madness, man. Someone can get their eye poked out by doing that. Now let's see, where am I supposed to go? We can't go through any of the other... You know, I think we're supposed to head to... Yeah, Dahlia Valley for the timing. Actually, wait, wait. I'm thinking, I'm trying to think now. I think we could go to Dahlia Valley. Yeah. Or maybe we need to go back to Soleil Town first. Uh, we'll find out soon enough. Unless we just blast through these turtles. I think it's cool how the enemies just explode. Well, not all enemies, just these ones. Oh no, that hurts. Ouch! Freaking turtles get... Boing? Yeah! Springboard. Uh-oh. Uh oh, here comes a flying enemy. I'll just throw my sword at it. Doesn't stand a chance. Okay, here we go. Ah! Uh, Haya! Ouch! <laughs> anyway, we'll top in here. It's a wolf! The old lady won't come out of the fireplace, so I will eat you instead! Grrr! Eat sword, fool! Oh well. What the heck, dude? It's freaking... So yeah, all you pretty much gotta do is throw your sword at him while avoiding all those weird things he throws out. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, just one more hit. There it is. No, it can't be! I lost to a human and to a mere boy! Ah, oh, poop. <laughs> Jiwo's maximum HP increases! Oh, thank you. The fortune teller was just here. She told us to hide in the fireplace because a monster was coming. She also said that you would come. She really does know all. Meet her in the plaza. It almost seems like she's more than human. Hmm. Thank you so much. Give my regards to the fortune teller at the plaza. Also, feel free to stop by when you're wounded. You're always welcome here. Okay, so we're running short on time. So I hope you all enjoyed this first episode of Crusader of Seni, and I will see you all next time. Jiwo out.